might say that I'm a loner But I just call it being free I am my heart's only owner Everyone. I'm Marie from Southern Country Living and today I'm making a real easy dessert. It's called Strawberry Pub Cake and you can also make this uh, easy dessert. It would be a good one to serve at a, at a Mother's Day meal or any meal really. So the ingredients are, I uh, have a regular cake mix here and it's um, called a Super Morris Cake Mix Betty Crocker and it's the vanilla. Then I have just what it takes to make the cake up. I have three eggs here, and you want to get them your eggs at room temperature. And I have a cup of water, and I have one third cup of vegetable oil. And over here for the um, icing, I have I'm going to use just a little over two cups of strawberries and some Eagle Brand milk. And I already have my pan sprayed. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put in my cake mix. I'm going to put in my eggs. This is three of them. And my one-third cup of oil. And my one cup of water. And I'm going to mix this up for about two minutes on medium speed. Okay, I have this all mixed up now, so I'm going to pour it in my 8x8 eight eight pan that's been sprayed. And boy, can you smell that vanilla in here. It smells wonderful. So I'll put this in a 325 oven for about 30 minutes and then I'll be back. I have my strawberries in my bow now and so I'm going to mash them up. And these are some big strawberries. <laughs> I'm going to give these a little chop. I thought I should have done that in the first place. There's that leaf again. Okay. That leaf don't want to come off. These were some big strawberries. <laughs> they were very pretty though. I thought that they might mesh right up, but they're just too big. <laughs> I love when strawberries start coming in and you can make all kinds of good strawberry recipes. And 
Let's try this again. Oh yeah, that's much better. Okay, that's enough of that. I think I'm going to use my beater now. <laughs> strawberries mixed up so now I'm going to um, put in my Eagle Brand milk Stir this in really good. Till it gets good and creamy. And when my cake comes out, I'm going to punch some holes in it and I immediately pour this over the warm cake. Got a really good pretty thick color to it so I'll see you in just a little while okay I just got my cake out of the oven and mine cooked in my oven at 325 for about 25 uh, minutes so just check your oven and uh, cook it till according to the way the directions say and the way your oven works okay so now then I'm gonna uh, poke holes in my cake Okay, so now then I'm going to pour the icing over the top of it. And this is a cake that you don't have to wait for it to cool to do this. says that you may have to poke some more holes in it after you uh, 
do it the first time, so I did, and so now I'm going to pour some more icing. I didn't put all of the icing out and uh, I'm going to save a little of it and so I'm going to put it in the refrigerator and let it cool for about two hours and then I'll be back. Okay it's been about two hours now and my strawberry poke cake has been uh, in the refrigerator so now I'm going to cut a piece of it. I hope it's as good as it looks. <laughs> Okay, there's the piece of my cake. And so now then I'm going to okay. Here's my cake and I'm ready to Taste test it. <laughs> okay. So now I'm going to do the taste test. Mm. It's very delicious. If I was going to do it again, I would make the hose a little bit bigger in the cake so that that juice would run down it more. And um, it has a real good taste to it though. So it didn't hurt that at all. <laughs> okay, so y'all, yeah, I'm gonna close out the video now. So y'all yeah, do what you love and love what you do. And y'all yeah, have a great um, rest of the evening. And uh, I'm gonna go enjoy my cake. So bye. About to leave. Already packing, come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action. What we can be, life with no distractions. We'll get away. This is what we wait.